Hi, I'm Dr. Deal with Deal Plastic Surgery. Today we're going to be doing a submental liposuction under local anesthesia. This is a really common procedure. Um, it's very well tolerated by the patients and we get beautiful results. So this is our patient. If she tips her nose down just a little bit, you can sort of see the area that frustrates her. She's got a beautiful face. She's got great skin. She just has a little bit of, of extra fullness there that um, she wants to take care of. And because of the elasticity of her skin, she's going to get a great result. thing we do after we've done our marks and our photos is just prep the patient and get them sterilely draped out. Even though this is under local anesthesia, we still do it completely sterile. So now we're just very gently getting some of this numbing fluid in and she might feel a little bit of pressure, but that's about all she's feeling right now. A few breaths of the Pronox, we can do this with no problem. We puff up this whole area that we want to work on and then she'll have really good numbing for the rest of the procedure. So this is our Smart Lipo laser. You can sort of see the light that's transmitted through the skin. We just gently, gently move it back and forth and back and forth. This is um, damaging some of the fat cells and it's um, giving us some better skin tightening, which is always a plus when we're doing submental liposuction. <clears throat> We also get less bruising with the laser. And of course, once you're not wearing your garment and out and about, you don't want bruises if we can avoid it. Our last and third step, the first step was to put the numbing in. The second step is to pass the laser. And the third step is to pass the, two, the um, suction cannula, which is a little three millimeter wide cannula. So our incision only has to be as wide to allow this cannula. It's a flat and spatulated tip, and then this is the side that suctions. So we're just going to gently move this cannula back and forth, and it's a little more jerky than the, the laser. But we're just trying to get little bits of fat out, and she doesn't have very much to give, like we said. But we'll get some, some reduction out um, of that very central portion on her. And more than anything, it's kind of waiting for the scar tissue and the, the tissue to tighten on the inside that'll give her the best results. Cover it up with a Band-Aid. Put her in her compression garment and she's ready to just get up and walk out of here. She's just numb in the area that we worked on. The Pronox has all been breathed off, so she's not feeling the effects of that anymore. And she's all done.